Now, I would like to introduce two men who worked tirelessly to help Volkswagen to settle here in Chattanooga and have been our strongest allies and indeed good friends as well. Senator Lamar Alexander and Senator Bob Kolker, please join me here on stage. I don't know whose water that was, but it was good. Thank you. <laughs> so, thank you, Lamar. And I want to thank Secretary LaHood for honoring us being here today, the Ambassador, Professor Winterhorn, Mr. Fisher, Mr. Browning, our Governor, my lifelong friend, Bill Haslam, our mayors, city and county, great partnership on most issues. My personal friend and partner, Claude Ramsey, who we owe a great deal of gratitude for for this moment. My personal friend, Governor Bredesen, for all he did to make this happen. To Tom Ed Wilson and Trevor Hamilton and their tremendous leadership at the Chamber of Commerce. To say that this is a great day would be an understatement. The greatest moment in my public career was receiving the call from the Volkswagen Group after their board meeting, at their board meeting, that they were coming to Chattanooga. And I want to thank you. I want to thank all of you for making that decision. This is, in fact, a marriage, as Lamar mentioned. It's a marriage that's been building for, for many, many years. Volkswagen, through lots of turns and tribulations, has ended up making their way to Chattanooga. And our community, had an incredible vision that we've held on to now for 20 years and through trials and tribulations and all kinds of things occurring, we held on to that vision. To me, today, this is a tribute to a company that wants to make an American product with American people in Tennessee and a tribute to a city that had the ability to hold on to a vision and to make that real today. The effect that this is going to have on generations of Tennesseans and Chattanoogans is incredible, and this is something that, that all of us long for. You know, three years ago, the engagement was announced. Today, certainly, the marriage is consummated, and now it's up to all of us to, uh, to ensure that, that the decision that Volkswagen made to come to Chattanooga and the decision that Chattanooga made to try to entice them here with efforts through the state of Tennessee was the right decision. You know, a lot of people have said that, that, that you, cannot make, you cannot manufacture in America anymore. And today proves that wrong. A lot of people have said that economic development is about having a field adjacent to an interstate. And again, today proves that wrong because it was those shared values, the fact that we kept our environment in balance, that we invested in education, that we cared about similar values that brought us here together. And a lot of people have said that America's best days are behind us. But today, I think, shows that that is not the case. And it's examples like this of great companies making an investment in a community that believed in itself throughout our country that I believe will prove that myth wrong. So I'm happy to be here. I'm thankful for the wonderful partnerships that have been created. And I look forward to working with Lamar and Bill, the leadership here, the leadership in our city and county, to ensure that the decision, that the announcement, that all that is happening today was the right decision for all involved. Thank you.